Hey, what's up, everyone? Yo, I want to give you guys uh, another tip that's, uh, on a mistake that I did. And luckily, I caught it while I was finishing up. I'm finishing up uh, right now. Finishing up uh, the entire cabinet. Just I'm zip tying and everything, cleaning up the wires. Right? So, these are the exciters I got, right? The Dayton's. So I used to have the ones that were like the ninja stars that just stuck on, right? But these had, this also has like the stick, stick stuff, but it has four screw things like to screw it down. So I'm like, I guess you gotta screw it down. You know, it doesn't come with no, no instructions. But then I plugged it into the amp and like there was no sound. It was, it was like crazy low. Like, I mean, whispering low. And I'm like, I, I couldn't figure it out. I'm like, I just kept going, you know, finishing up. I was installed the, the bass shaker. And then I, I could smell something burning. So I'm like, oh, here we go. And so I'm thinking maybe it's just the glue, like the new glue. And it's not, it's, I touched this, this, it burnt my hand. If I would have left this, I had four screws in here. If I would have left this screwed in, it would have set this on fire, there's no doubt in my mind. If I left it running, you know what I mean? I mean, obviously music would have to be going through, but. So, uh, there's a hint. Learn from the idiot. <laughs> when you get your uh, exciters, don't screw them down. Uh, actually, once uh, I took the screws out and it gave it space, uh, and it, you know, it's just on there with the stick, the glue, the glue, the, the, the glue that comes on it or whatever. Um, once it, once it comes uh, with that, uh, then you, it's loud, you know, because it's you, it got room to move uh, back and forth, and then, uh, and you get your sound, and then it doesn't overheat. But uh, so. <laughs> Take it from me. Learn from my mistakes. Uh, I was close.